Okay, so our next topic in our explainer series is all about elastics. Yes. And not to confuse yourself, which I may or may not have done in the past. Yeah. Talk so, us through some of your favourites, then, Jay. Not too much favourites. What I want to talk about is that phrase I use a lot: is keeping things simple. Elastic choices. Love it. So we see so much, don't we, where people come out coaching with us? You'll say, "What elastics you got, mate?" Just so. And it's, got. it's messages as well, isn't it? What elastics should you use for this, that, and the other? Yeah. So the, the mistake people make is carrying. They have 10 tockets, say, it's about standard, isn't it? 10 tockets these days, maybe not that many, but yeah, eight. Too, mate, don't you? And they'll literally have one of everything. Yeah, mum. Do you know what I mean? And lots of them will be different companies, but the same, and you think. Yeah. It, it's getting out of hand, it's getting confusing. Definitely. I mean, people try too much, do you know what I mean? Oh, I'll just try. What it's about the elastics, I find, is we have two spells of the year, don't we? We have winter elastics, we have summer elastics. Yeah, definitely. Much. We're just on that change now. Yeah. What are we? Middle of March, just yeah, on the yeah. change. It's cold still, isn't it? But the fish are chewing. They're starting to feed. Yeah, mum. I like to go with. Um, I have three big tubes in my carry all, and I literally have ten of three lots of elastic. Do you know what I mean? Oh, it's a lot, but I use it with coaching. I go through a lot. Third, third, third. So I literally have lots of each. Yeah, get you. I mean, it just keeps things simple. But I literally have. So I'm, I've raved about it for years. I'm a fan of slick. Yeah, that's what I'm on now. Is yeah. I love that. But regardless of what elastic you choose, do you know what I mean? Whether it's hollow, solid, whatever, um, it's about keeping you just a few of each rating. I mean, I have the. Um, we won't call, call, use colours, we use ratings. I have yeah. 10 of the 8 to 10, yeah. 10 of the 10 to 12, yeah. and 10 of the... No, I'm telling lies, I'm telling lies, I don't. Stop lying to I these get, lovely folks, I get, Jay. The, the green's the 8 to 10, I don't, that, that's about to go. The green's about what, nearly too soft. Like two, that's, I'll use me red, soft. sorry, yeah. I'll use yeah. 10 to 12, yeah. I'll have a tube of 10 to 12, I'll have a tube of 12 to 14, yeah. and a tube of 14 to 16. Jamie, are you sure? Yeah, I will. Yeah, is, it, is that what red, you're on? Yeah. red, orange, and yellow. You know what I mean? So I have one tube of each, and it right. just simply allows me to have one elastic for all my F1s, my smaller fish, or more so. Perfect, I, I don't know what you think. It's more so my hook length diameters. So yeah, I man. might use the red for any time that I'm going to use 010 to 013. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the next one up again, that'd be the orange, the 12 to 14, that'd be 013 to 015, my, my small like carp. That, yeah, and, yeah. and then you've got your angry one. Definitely. You know what I mean? That could be 020 or, yeah, or yeah. who knows what. So just by having three, and whether it's slick or hollows these days, it doesn't yeah, make a difference. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You find if you stick with them three, that they, they cover everything. Yeah, definitely. But other than utter, utter riot gear, where you've got a big snaggy, horrible peg or something, mm. that, that that's the one-off. That's when you need something stupid. I think, yeah, that's the case. It depends on, obviously, venues where you're going to, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. If, if you a case somewhere like this... You don't need to, do you? It's always nice, civilised, sensible. It's very rare. I have one angry top kit, and yeah, it, yeah. It, some it. years it doesn't come out. Very, I was going to say, very rarely it come out, would it? No. Yeah, sensible. That that sort of top end that would be the green in your map stuff. I think that's that four to sixteen. Ten to fourteen. As well. yeah, 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 yeah. That's as heavy as I go. Yeah, that, that's about you need. That to be the same yeah, as our yeah. yellow. Definitely. As long, once you get to that sort of thing, black hydro. So the yellow slick. They're getting the it. Green. They're having black hydro, folks. Them fish are having it, aren't yeah. they? Well, the, you know what I mean? Yeah. Black's probably is that similar to the green? The map. A little bit heavier, isn't it? Yeah. Well, it's, so it's, it's 12 to 16. Probably grey hydro yeah, yeah, then. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Uh, on Preston. It's 13H, isn't it? Uh, 13H. 13H, yeah. Yeah. So, so all them sort of elastic, whatever company it's, it may it's, be. And it's like that similar number that you're getting at, isn't it? So like from a 10 to a 14 grade, and obviously yeah. 13H comes into it. Black Idol's 12 to 16, that comes into it. You yeah. know what I mean? All of those, that needs to be your top end of elastic. Yeah, you know I mean, definitely. You, unless you're somewhere quite unique and specific. That's, that's your heavy one, isn't it? 100%. That's your big right. carp one, then you want a... Normal everyday carpy one, a little bit of everything, and then your F20 one. So just by having three top kits, or three lots of top Simplifies kits in that rating, it, doesn't it? Yeah, and it means you've got lots of top kits to do. I mean, if you if we rock up a partridge, yeah, yeah, yeah. you're going to use six or seven of the same top kit with yeah. the same elastic. The last thing you want is only one of them definitely. elastics because everything's a bit lighter or a bit heavier. Yeah, definitely. It lets you suit your elastic to your venue so much easier by having a limited option. I mean, yeah, so covers everything. I'm going to throw a spanner in the works now, folks, because I like to be a little bit different. Um, I think you got onto these at the back end of last year, and that's the F1 kits, you know, the little short yeah. kits. Yeah, they changed things Mate, a bit. Mate, honestly, I'm a massive fan. I've been using them for years now, and they allow you to fish a lighter elastic, but it's under sort of a little bit more yeah, tension because the length. kits are so short. Yeah. And honestly, folks, if you've not used them, you've got to get on them. Uh, when you're these fish across, it's one ship back, one pull, and they're there like, what's going on? The fish don't wear, know where that pressure's yeah, coming from. That's with on. elastics that you wouldn't be able to use, really wouldn't be suitable Sort of like in for the time kit. of year in the long kit, because you just have elastic all over the yeah. place. So yeah. I'm talking like, like you know, pink. 
yeah our pink sort of six to nine grade or five to eight something like that be all over the place but in a short kit wowzers yeah. does it make a difference it's just like you say it's one pull lift up done it's awesome now obviously sort of like from um this time of year just gone i've been using single single elastic single solid sixes that's all yes. i pretty much use all winter mm. uh, and then obviously i'm exactly the same as you i'll use a six to nine six to ten which is pretty much identical yeah. and then we tend to 14 that's it no point complicating anything now but no, them f1 not. kits man just ridiculous yeah i'm gonna use them more this year no don't because you catch even more fish than you do anyway <laughs> like you say, it gives it's you like another, another grade of elastic sort of it's a weird one that. it does and obviously I, I may or may not like shallow fishing and like it just stiffens your pole up completely so imagine a short kit and then a short three on top and then if you're fishing like six meters it's just ridiculous mate catch so many fish but Jump yeah on. coming coming back to elastics again obviously uh, it's all about simplifying everything in fishing and certainly with elastics there's that much choice out there but just just stick to them three grades yeah a lightest one one a little bit heavier medium-ish and then obviously a heavier one yeah which doesn't really tend in our fishing it doesn't really tend to come out that often does it no the heavy heavy one no not really not really only for your big fish down the edge and... yeah definitely but even then you know obviously the, the trouble uh, that, that we encounter a lot as coaches is anglers obviously fishing too heavy elastic as soon as they hear the word carp yeah. you know they're just gearing up for them fishing far too heavy whereas obviously the fisheries that we're on a lot of them are mixed fisheries certainly f1s eyed skimmers if you're fishing too heavy for them you're going to be bumping them yeah. so obviously just use a lighter grade elastic yeah. uh, always with a puller kits. Puller so kits pullers have changed the world of fishing thing. gone are the days of putting sections and sections on and stand on your box <laughs> and letting his carp yeah which has been known it's just getting back to your top kit and you know you watch this fella he gets about to top kit just keeps pulling the fish like don't know what's going on it's there keep on pulling it does you it make me you. sick man but now yeah the, the basic what we're trying to get at to then is is the keeping the choices simple and limited yeah. and above all it's what you're matching your elastic to is your hook length definitely that's what it mainly mate. comes down to yeah, doesn't it it's your massive. hook length diameter yeah that dictates your elastic you never ever want to be overpowering your hook length with a too strong or elastic yeah so what i mean and obviously by that is you don't want to be using like a, an old 10 up length like so two pound and old school money to like a heavy 10 to 14 inch carp elastic no, one strike it's not too much pressure on that it's going to break here yeah, it's matching your your bottom end of your tackle your main line's nearly irrelevant yeah yeah, yeah. to your to your elastic yeah maybe your hook as well if you want to go really into it but no by having those three that'll allow you to fish them anything from 0 to L, uh, 0 10 even all the way up to whatever you want to fish yeah keeps just nice and yeah simple. so numbers wise Jay, we're saying sort of like what threes to say six or seven or something for like a lighter stuff and then say seven to ten for medium and then up to like what 10 to 14 or 16 for heavy yeah just stick to them numbers as i say all companies do different elastics don't they yeah but if you stick to them numbers folks you'll not go far wrong you're not too far like that you like that mate love that oh yeah elastic sorted <laughs> <laughs> Done.